This is Benny, the most space-tastic spaceman hero in the Lego movie. He loves building spaceships, but no one ever lets him. One day, Benny went to a meeting with his master builder friends. He met some awesome new friends, too. Suddenly, bad guys attacked. Benny tried to build a spaceship, but his friends wanted to build a submarine instead. And it falls apart. They really should have built a spaceship. Spaceship! Things were looking pretty bad, when suddenly the bad cop became a good cop. He told Benny to build a spaceship to save everyone. Benny gets super psyched. Spaceship! 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 Benny's spaceship carries all his friends into battle, and they defeat all the evil robots. Now people cheer spaceship wherever he goes, and everyone wants to go for a ride with Benny. Spaceship! The end. This is the story of how Batman saved Bricksburg in the Lego movie. He was hanging out in his bat cave one day when he got an unexpected call. What's that? Bricksburg citizens are in trouble. Sure, I'll save them. So Batman built a super cool bat plane and rescued them in the nick of time. Turns out it was his girlfriend, a super happy guy, and an old magical dude. He flew them all to a really wild and crazy cloud place where everyone was out of control happy and a little bit intense. But the bad guys showed up and broke everything. And Batman had to save everybody again! Then Batman had to distract the bad boss guy while everyone else tried to sneak into the base. But they failed. So Batman rallied all the people by himself and they beat the bad guys once and for all! Time for some celebratory sick beats and moves! Now he has time to play video games and munch on lobster in peace. The end. This is the story of the coolest cat in the whole world, Princess Unikitty. She's the star of the Lego movie and lives in a place called Cloud Cuckoo Land, where everybody loves to dance and there are no rules, except for no mustaches. One day, Unikitty goes to a meeting with a bunch of her friends, when suddenly, bad guys show up and ruin everything. Unikitty vows revenge. She goes deep undercover as Business Kitty to sneak into the bad guy's face. Business, 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 numbers. But then, Unikitty sees her friends in danger. It makes her angry, really angry. Working together, Unikitty and her friends save the world. And the moral of the story is, don't make Unikitty angry. You won't like her when she's angry. The end. This is Wild Style, but some people call her Lucy. She's super amazing and my favorite character from the Lego movie. Wild Style goes on a mission to find a special piece, but this guy Emmett gets it first by accident. She has to rescue Emmett from bad robots by building an awesome motorcycle. Wild Style takes Emmett to meet some other master builders like her. It doesn't go so well. But Wildstyle decides to help him anyway. Oh, and so does Batman. Batman's there too. They sneak into the bad guy's TV studio and she sends out a message. Hey everyone, build stuff to fight the robots! In the end, Emmett gets all the credit. But Wildstyle decides she likes him anyway. She realizes he's awesome just the way he is. And she can be the pow in power couple. Mission accomplished. The end. This is a story about a guy named Emmett in the super cool movie they made about him. Emmett is always happy and smiling, even though everyone ignores him. One day he finds a red Lego piece that gets stuck to his back. And a girl named Wildstyle tells him he's special. <gasps> Emmett likes being special until bad guys start chasing him. Wildstyle takes Emmett to meet an old guy who teaches him how to be special. But the bad guys show up again. 
Emmett uses his special ideas to hide from them. The old guy tells Emmett he is ready to fight Lord Business, so he teams up with the crazy unicorn cat, a pirate robot, and a super psyched space dude to take down the baddies. Oh yeah, and Batman too. But it turns out the old guy might have been wrong. Thankfully, Emmett has learned a lot. He leads his friends in the ultimate throwdown showdown. Emmett tells Lord Business not to be mean, and Lord Business says he is sorry. And they all live happily ever after. The end?